Samsung has just revealed its new Galaxy series, the Galaxy S23. The phone comes with better quality cameras, long life batteries, and a powerful processor. However, the slowing global demand for smartphones serves as a challenge as the new phones hit the shelves later this month. Our Kim Hyun Seng reports. Samsung has just unveiled its first flagship phones of 2023 the Galaxy S23 series. The trio, the S23, the S23 Plus, and the S23 Ultra comes packed with better camera features and gaming capabilities. The front camera has been upgraded from 10 megapixels to 12 megapixels. Battery capacity gets a boost to 5,000 milliampers per hour, which can comfortably last throughout the day with moderate usage. And the S23 series comes equipped with a powerful processor, the Snapdragon 8 Gen 2, which, according to Samsung, has a 40% increased performance the compared Galaxy to its predecessor. Has Samsung has also gotten rid of the backside contour cut for the cameras, opting for a more stylish look. The phone's cameras use improved AI technology, which detects objects in front of the lens and shifts its conditions to take the optimal shot. Perhaps one of the most impressive features is the Astro Hyperlapse on the S23 Ultra, which allows users to take time-lapse photographs of stars without any special gadgets. The S23 series are also the first smartphones on the market to use Gorilla Glass Victus 2, making them more durable against drops and everyday wear and tear. However, some found first impressions to be underwhelming. Some online gadget reviewers called it a a minor upgrade from the S22. But an expert says that the impressive horsepower of the S23 series will be best felt when used. S23 is the, uh, I think, best phone in the world right now, I think. In terms of experience, people can feel, wow, that's a lot much better. The S23 also may not receive as much fanfare as usual due to tough economic times. Demand for new smartphones has fallen, with global smartphone shipments dipping almost one-fifth on-year in the last quarter of 2022. Samsung also earlier this week reported an earnings shock, an on-year plunge of 97% in its semiconductor division in the last quarter amid lower demand for semiconductors. The S23 also has to stand out from its competitors, Apple 14 and Google Pixel 7. The S23 series will hit the shelves worldwide on February 17th. Pre-orders in South Korea start on the 7th. Kim Hyun-sung, Arirang News.